All right, so he's just going to go, and he's as he goes. All right, I mean, he's at stop here. We'll stop for a second. He is at a at ten, and then five. I'm just going to read those numbers: ten, and then ten, five. Right? Okay, keep going. Twenty and ten. Thirty and twelve. Forty and fifteen. Fifty and seventeen. Sixty and nineteen. Seventy and twenty. Eighty and twenty one. Ninety and twenty two. One hundred and twenty three. One ten and twenty five. One twenty and twenty five. One thirty and twenty six. One forty and twenty seven. One fifty and twenty eight. One sixty and thirty. One seventy and thirty one. One eighty and thirty two. One ninety and thirty three. Two hundred and thirty five. Two ten and thirty six. Two twenty and thirty eight. Two thirty and thirty eight. Two forty and thirty nine. Two fifty and forty. Two sixty and forty one. Two seventy and forty three. Two eighty and forty five. Two ninety and forty six. Three hundred and forty nine. Three ten and fifty. Three twenty and fifty two. Three thirty and fifty five. Three forty and fifty eight. Three fifty and sixty. Three sixty and hold on and stop. Three sixty and seventy. Now I probably you probably figured I was going up, right? At some point that I jumped through. So we'll talk. All right, so now what are we at? Three fifty and what? Oh, no. Three sixty we're at. Three sixty and seventy three. Three seventy and uh eighty. Three eighty and Okay, now we're there. Stop. 380, you see as it starts to move, we're about 380 and 90. Keep going now. 390 and 95. And now just keep cranking. I'm sick of writing numbers. Yeah, it ain't going nowhere anyways. It's done. What's, it's, what's not going anywhere? It's a crack already. Keep going. Just keep going now. There, now you see. Keep going. See those shear cracks coming. All right. Now stop. Now, is it still holding something yep, up? Yep, still holding quite a bit, actually. And Terrell, that was good, but I think we're going to have to pull the video, I think. Hmm? Did, did, did it work? I got all the numbers. Okay, yep. And I think it was good, because it was weird, because I went around, I probably didn't call, right? You know, but we'll see what the video looks like. Now, you can back it off. Now, it still is holding up. Keep going and or no? Go backwards now, watch what happens. As he's going back, it is rebounding. It is rebounding. In other words, until this has got no force on it, it's still holding something up. So it's still, it's, and I'll let you, okay, he's off now. He's backed it all the way off, so at some point it backed off. Now what we have here is the classic shear. You see those angles? That's your classic shear. Great. And all the way through here, as you start breaking it apart, there's a nice classic shear. So it looks very similar to what we perfect, saw by concrete. Yeah. Perfectly. Actually, it's perfect shear. Yeah, it's like perfect shear, and it's got a certain, you know, it's got an angle to it. We can measure it, right? Later on, hopefully the video keeps, Mark doesn't erase it, right? Now, where it finds it, it actually came through. It didn't really even come through an end crack, did it? came close, but not an end crack. So you've got basically um, that kind of classic shear failure. And we have, based on that data, some sort of number based on this, based on the area. And so that's the number I don't know if I got you to get. The cross-sectional area of that is one last number we want, or the radius across. So we should have then on that sheet, I'm going to go ahead and turn this off. The original length on this was 2 inches. Two inches. And the uh, diameter, so you can just give me a diameter on that. Uh, one and a quarter. So one and a quarter inches diameter. 
thereabouts. Now the reality is, we'll leave that around, and you'd measure best the diameter by measuring a pie tape. You would take a piece of string and measure around it, because it ain't round, it's not round, it's not oblong, and so then you could do a back calculation on its area based on something called a pie tape. Micrometer. Okay, so I'm going to turn that off.